Reacher season two has finally ended. And I gotta say this, everybody, this was another great season of Reacher. What's going on with Reacher this time? He's traveling the road. He is doing justice upon the streets. You know, he doesn't want to be connected to anybody until someone threatens the people he loves. Then he goes full-blown nuclear. Reacher in season two finds out that one of his uh, men, one of his uh, attacks force that he created, has been killed. So he assembles his old group, his old teammates, his old friends, the special investigations unit, and to find out why was this former man, why was this member killed? Why was this person killed? And now he must seek revenge along with his other four three of my other members of the special investigations unit. And in this season, it's a, just a straight up revenge thing. It's simple, it goes straight to the point. We get flashback scenes of Reacher, how this task force came to be, how they became a family, how this, how this unit of a bunch of misfits who had a code, became a family. So, Reacher Season 2, all the end of the day, was just a simple thing season. It had good action, had great acting. I will say, though, I like Season 1 slightly a bit more than Season 2, but Season 2 is just as great as Season 1. If you wanted to tell me, oh, Season 2 was better than Season 1, I could give you that. But the reason why I prefer Season 1, because there was a lot of unknowns. We didn't know really much about Reacher, he didn't have no special connection to anybody in the dang show in season one other than like this one person. But he was also he had to build his friendships. He had to build up his relationships in season one. In season two, we already know he had these friendships. You just get flashback scenes of these friendships. Then you get to see how far he's willing to go for these friends of his. So these friends who are technically his family. Because they are his unit. They are his a special investigations unit. And the thing is, though, the overall plot of this entire thing, thing is just Reacher getting revenge on the, uh, his dead t his dead teammates, his dead co-worker, his dead family member, in a sense. And ultimately, reunite with his old group, his old task force, to take down the this evil group of bad guys who are, uh, who killed his best friend, killed one of his good friends. So, overall, Reacher Season 2, there's not really much to it in the overall storyline. He does give a love interest. He does uh, has potential to change, but the, all the end of the day, Reach is gonna reach, and Reacher is basically gonna be like, "Hey, after I'm done killing all these enemies and all that other stuff, and I, I will always survive, I'm just gonna go back on the road with my toothbrush, and that's it. I don't need nothing much else for Reacher. Reacher is just simply eight episodes, good action, good storyline, no waste uh, for space, no waste to like." Uh, like there are just you know those filler episodes this season of reacher like the first season of reacher wastes no time it just expands upon characters not one minute of screen time it goes out to do something stupid it doesn't make sense reacher season two was a triumph return of reacher i loved it it was great b plus a minus i don't know what to give it officially but overall reacher season two i'm going to give a solid b plus What's your personal opinion about Reacher Season 2? You think it's better than Season 1? You think Season 1 was better? Did you like the villain? Did you like the ending? What was your favorite episode of Reacher Season 2? Please know what y'all think. Did you at least care for everybody? Bye-bye.